Hello everybody and welcome to Kyle Filters Reviews. Today I'm not actually going to do a review, I'm actually going to show you my DVD collection. Um, so there's a snippet I suppose of it in the background. I've got a shave, um, do you like it? I don't. I'd rather have the stubble but never mind. <laughs> So it is approaching Christmas and I'm feeling slightly festive. I'm gonna do some other kind of videos. So rather than doing movie reviews or playing Gario, um, today I'm gonna to go through some of my DVD collection. Um, and then later on I might do like my top ten Christmas films or something. Um, you know. Uh, then of course we've always got my Marvel films that I need to do. I'm planning on watching the second one, Iron Man, soon. Reviewing that. That's like my main. I think I'm gonna keep that as my main sort of focus point of the channel, and then just spiral off from that. So I think there's one of them coming. But for now, I'm gonna show you my DVDs. So let's go. So we're all in alphabetical order, starting with um, you know, zero, one, twos, and threes. Um. So yeah, so I've got all of these, and then all of them, and then we go into the A's, Abduction, About Time, All the American Pies, which is just a little trophy from where I used to play football when I was like 12. Um, what else we got? And then you go into the B's, By a Teacher, all the Back to the Future films and Batman films, obviously, Big Daddy, or Big Mama films. And you've got all of these to go through, so I'll kick this out the way now. Oh, and I thought... I might show you my um, cinema tickets as well. For some reason, I just clicked all my cinema tickets. So that is all my cinema tickets. And a bit. So, going up to C's and... Well, the rest of B's first. Um, Blade, the Bourne films. Uh, what else we got? Oh, very good film. Crank. Love that film. Uh, Mr. Deeds, director. Oh, yeah, all the diehards. Very good... Uh, Films E. I don't know why E is yellow and the rest are white, but uh, yeah, E is a different color. And then we've got the rest of the E's, all the Expendables, my Apple Watch, all the Fast and Furious films, uh, all Final Destination films, Footloose, both the old one and the recent one, Forrest Gump, absolute classic. Uh, what else we got? And then we've got H, all the Hangovers, all the Harry Potters, other than the last one because my girlfriend Ashley's got that one for some reason. All the Hobbits, of course. Uh, all the Hunger Games, other than Mock J Part 2 because it isn't out yet. Um, Human Centipede, plan on getting the other two at some point. Indiana Jones, obviously, Steven Spielberg, classic. I was just looking there and I thought, hmm, yeah, Indiana Jones, classic. And um, Forrest Gump, classic. Um, I mean, you guys, I don't know what you want from my content, but maybe someday I might do some like old classic like film reviews. Because obviously I'm planning on going to cinema and then reviewing them films. So films like Back to the Future and, you know, Forrest Gump and what other classics have we got? You know, all the old ones like that, they're not going to get reviewed. I haven't got any light anymore because of my shadow. Um, moving on into N O P. Paul's a good film. I do love Paul. Funny film of um, was it Simon Pegg? Um, where's that guy? Go in here first. Um, all parts of the Caribbean, of course. They're bringing out another parts of the Caribbean in 2016, I think, as far as I can remember. Both of the big perfect plastics. Oh, I messed up plastic. I must watch that again. It's a very good film. The Raid, ah, oh, The Raid was a funny film. I thought, um, you know, it was obviously going to be a karate thing, and then the whole film turned out to be um, in a different language. <laughs> so that was... The Apes, my all-time favourite film. Dawn of the Planet Apes is there, but obviously it doesn't come out. It's not, it doesn't begin with R, so it's up in the D section. Um, all the Rush Hour, 
classics, all Saw films, classics. Um, Shaun of the Dead, Shawshank Redemption. Wow, what a classic that is, Jesus. So yeah, I might have to do some reviews someday of those. Uh, what else we got? All Spider-Man, Step Up 5, yeah. All Taken films, yeah, they're classic. Ted 2, all the Terminator films. Tintin, that's a very good animation film. Um, I'm definitely review that at some point. Brilliant film. All the Transformers, all the Transporters, all the Twilight films, all the Underworld films, Unstoppable, all of Wall Street, very good film, both the old one and the new one, Shia LaBeouf and, uh, what's his name, oh, DiCaprio, uh, Wildcard, Wolverine, Wolfman, all the wrong turns, all the X-Men films, of course, um, XXX, blah, 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 and then, this is the start of my, um, like, Disney and Pixar and all of that, so I'm planning on getting, you know, all of them, like, um, Wally and Brave and, you know, all of that stuff, so I'll be getting them, Ratatouille, I think I just mentioned, um, what else, Cars, Cars 2, Monsters University, so yeah, that'd be that, you're probably wondering <laughs> where all of my Marvel films are, because I didn't mention them, well, because I love Marvel, they have their own little space. You might think, oh, why is Iron Man and Iron 2 there and Iron Man 3 over there? That's because that's not how they go. They go. Captain America, First Avenger, Iron Man, Iron Man 2. The Incredible Hulk with Edward Norton. However, he changes into Mark Ruffalo somehow. Um, Thor, Avengers Assemble, Iron Man 2, Thor Dark World, Captain America, Winter Soldier, Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, Avengers, Age of Ultron, Ant-Man, and then obviously... Civil War, which should be coming out May 6th, 2016. And we've got some jars. Um, and then we've got over here all my James Bond film. Look at that, that looks amazing. I should probably be doing it like that. If I do it like that, there's no black bars out there. <laughs> what an idiot. But I'm not gonna, re gonna record all that again, so I'll just do it like this from now on. Oh well. Uh, and then I've got all my box sets over here. So we've got Idiot Broad, I need Idiot Broad too. Hope I might get that for Christmas. Uh, Breaking Bad, All Gossip Girl, Hustle, In Between Us, there's the light there. Jackass, Misfits, Mrs. Brown Boys, Scooby Doo, that was really old. Norman Wisdom, he's an absolute legend, he's a classic, and obviously The Walking Dead. And then over here, I've got a pile of films I need to watch. <laughs> and The Flash. I'm currently watching The Flash because The Flash is absolutely brilliant. Um, The Flash, do you want me to review that? Let me know, comments below. I'd love to know if you'd uh, want me to review that. And then, yeah, well, a n number of films that um, I need to watch. So, um,. So, there we go. That is my um, movie collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I'm going to get the light out of my way. Um, I hope you like this um, move, the movie review. It's not even a movie review. This tour of my films, I suppose. Um, let me know. What's your favourite movie? I'd love to know in the comments below. Um, and, you know, I was just thinking then. Maybe I could do, like, a room tour. I mean, there you go. That's my bedroom there, obviously. But, um... Yeah, maybe I could do like a, a movie tour, a room tour or something. Um, but yeah, let me know, go, let me let you let, yeah, let me know, guys, what you want. I got a clue what I'm saying. <laughs> um, yeah, let me know if you want like um, classic reviews or I mean, I can even start doing series. Obviously, like the Flash, like, I love watching the Flash and Walking Dead, so I could obviously start reviewing those if you wanted me to. So um, yeah, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but anyway, thanks for now. Thanks for watching. If you did like this uh, video, please leave a like, comment really help me out um and always uh, merry christmas <laughs>